Were the Atlanta Falcons trying to make a trade for Jordan Love? Did the New Orleans Saints want Jordan Love? Was Seattle or Carolina daydreaming about Jordan Love? I don't want to hear you need to find out what you have with Jordan Love. You know what you have. He can't play. This is going to be a predictable disaster with Jordan Love in Green Bay. He is what I was told throughout the offseason I thought he would be. He's a game manager. There's no special there. If you're still wearing floaties, year four in the pool, you're not Michael Phelps. In fact, maybe swimming's not for you. I know what you're saying. Colin, how can you judge him on that? It's year four. I'm going to judge him on a clean pocket, wide open tight end, miss him badly on a third down. I think a lot of people look at Jordan Love, and for some strange reason, they hold it against him that he couldn't beat out Aaron Rodgers, who oh. was a two-time MVP. Nobody Jordan Love was a great that. prospect. A great Fire. prospect. High ceiling. Oh, no, you're lying. Wrong. Fire. You lie. Because when he was drafted in the first round, almost everybody was like, Jordan Love first round pick? So no, he was not a highly touted prospect. He wasn't. That's a flat out lie. Who Wrong. Why did nobody okay. take him for 27 picks? He was there. He was available. Nobody took him. I can't tell you how much joy it brings me to see this man, Jordan Love, play. I mean, I never thought Love was a good quarterback, but man, this dude stinks. Right from the jump, this guy was missing passes I've seen Rodgers make a hundred times. Then on back-to-back -back third and 16s, this dude thought he was prime Michael Vick. It's getting worse. Now everybody's got film, people have tape, he's losing confidence, and they can see what he can't do. Throw the ball down the field. Can he be tier two? I don't see it. He's a backup. This was one of those games. Be honest, cheeseheads. You got your calendar and circled this one. This is the one you're like, oh, oh, after we play Detroit, that'll be a tough one. Detroit's good. But then we get all this time off and face the Raiders. The analytics, the warnings, the first half data, like... Well, uh, this guy dropped a ball. Have you seen what Lamar Jackson's dealing with? Guys are dropping touchdowns. If you've been around a while, rookie Jordan Love, I give you Thanksgiving first year. We're four weeks from Thanksgiving, and unless this kid goes on a heater for the next three or four weeks, I've seen enough. Jordan Love feels like a really long second date, and the first one didn't go particularly well. Okay. And there were huge questions about him. He was a weak first-round pick. He was Brandon Whedon or E.J. Manuel or Christian Ponder. Just go back to his draft class. Herbert's been good for years. Burrow's been good for years. Two has been good for a couple. Jalen Hurts has been good for three. We're still waiting for Jordan Love. And the worst part of this is that the Packers knew it. Young quarterbacks that have it, Trevor Lawrence, get better. Andrew Luck, get better. Burrow, get better. To bumpy first year, better, 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 better. Thanksgiving's a month out. Better go on a heater, but I think they know. Will Love be the next great quarterback in Green Bay? Absolutely not. He's been awful. That game on Monday night, that was an atrocious performance. He was terrible against the Lions when the game was there to be won. If anybody's going to sit there right now and tell me that what they have seen out of Jordan Love, that he's a big-time player. Where have you seen it? When he had his cameo appearances prior to this year, he didn't play great. He wasn't great at Utah State. He sat there for three or four years, and his performance on Monday night, Molly, was absolutely awful against the Raiders. So the answer is no. And I, I think when you look at the Packers, their quarterback situation is already settled. Jordan Love's not going to be their quarterback next year. Wait from the Packers' point of view. Bye bye, Jordan Love. No, come on. See you never. No, no. Like, like I know we're no, being no, 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 no. Look, if you thought Jordan Love was the Packers, I'm being serious here. If you thought he was the quarterback of the future, obviously he's finishing out the year. I'm not saying they're benching it, but the Packers this offseason will be scouting every single quarterback in the draft. It is extremely likely they will have a record where they're picking top ten and can take one. And Jordan Love's time in Green Bay will come to an end in the middle of next season. See, I'm not going. I know we've been kind of bouncing back and forth on Jordan Love. Like, oh, get rid of. Like, they should nah, get rid he's of him. Done. Oh, they're. How you like me now?